Hi everybody! Um, it has been a little bit since my last video. I do apologize. I needed to take a break. I've just been... Uh, I've just been dealing with a lot, but everything's going good. You know, life happens, basically. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to do a little bit of skincare and just kind of talk a little bit about, uh, I guess, where I've been. It's I think it's been like a week, eight days or something. Um, but considering I was really on a kick as far as a consistent upload, it's, it is frustrating when there's a long break. Um, so, you know, for those of you who have stuck around, I really appreciate it. Um, you know, I've hit 30 subscribers, which is crazy to me, um, in a good way, obviously. Uh, I just, 30 people's a lot of people, so that's really cool. Um, so as far as updates go, I have been working a ton. Um, I have two jobs. Oh my God, this looks insane. <laughs> there we go. Um, so I do have two jobs. Uh, you know, I don't just work at Ulta anymore because realistically, um, when you work retail, you're subject to your hours changing unless you're full time. And even if you're full time, I'm sure there's things that you have to deal with hourly schedule, all that. Um, side note, I'm going to wash my face with a Neutrogena Hydro Boost wipe because I worked today, so I was very sweaty. Um, but yeah, I have a second job and it's very physically demanding, very, uh, customer oriented, and lately I've just been really stressed out and, um, you know, I won't lie, um, because I don't necessarily like my second job as much as I should, um, you know, it's triggered, triggered some mental health stuff, um, just that as well as like life being a little crazy for a little while. Um, you know, th things pop up and even when you're on a creative kick, when your mental health changes, like I've said it before, I just have a very hard time pushing through and making videos when I'm not myself. Um, so, you know, not to, I don't know, not to discourage having a hobby. It's just the YouTube hobby um, you know, it just doesn't, it doesn't give me the comfort and relaxation that other hobbies do for people, you know, like painting or something like I, it's just not quite the same for me. Like I really haven't worn a lot of makeup lately and like, that's not how I am. I wear makeup pretty consistently. So when I don't wear makeup, when I go through a period of not wearing anything, um, you know, people will call me out. They'll be like, Hey, how you doing? Like you doing okay? Like, <laughs> so it's just been a little tough lately. And, um, yeah, I, I plan on getting back on the horse for content. I, uh, I just needed a little break. So, um, for those of you that are caring and understanding, you get it. <laughs> uh, for those of you that also have some mental health stuff going on. I see you. I support you. I get it. <laughs> um, so for face oil, I'm using the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula Skin Therapy Oil. That's a mouthful. Sorry. There it is. Um, there we go. I get a good decent size. My skin has been horrible lately as far as just being acne prone and just dries nasty oily and dry at the same time combination skin it's fun <laughs> so I'm just gonna get a big old layer here I do use a lot of face oil I am aware of that um but my skin's real bad real bad 
and it's from stress and hormones and all that so it happens so I'm gonna let this skit skit I'm gonna let this sit on my skin for a minute or two before I put on um, my moisturizer which has not changed um, I mean, I really fell off the wagon with my skincare, which is probably why my skin is gotten as bad as it has. Um, but yeah, you know, I'll use either a face oil from Ordinary or I'll use this one. I prefer this one um, results wise, but the Ordinary is easier to get your hands on. I don't know what stores sell this. I know Amazon does, but there's nothing wrong with the Ordinary too. It's a good brand. And then for moisturizer, I use the COSRX Snail All-in-One Cream. I know everybody swears by the Essence, but I haven't tried it yet. Ugh. Also, I didn't say anything about it, but I just realized, because uh, it hasn't been very long since I had blonde hair, um... And before anybody hops on the whole, like, oh, every time someone has a mental breakdown, they dye their hair thing. Like, no, I just, I wanted pink hair for, like, m a couple months. And I just, like, couldn't decide if I wanted to do pink or a different color. And I finally just woke up one morning and was like, nope, we're doing pink. So, I'll have y'all know, I was planning on dyeing my hair pink. I just, I love being blonde. Blonde is my favorite, um... It's just, it's very much who I am. I'm a blonde. But I can't not experiment with colors. I don't know how to not do that. <laughs> like, uh, I had green hair, I think, was my last color before I stopped and pretty much stuck to blonde. Uh, I had, like, green and gray, and then I went brown when I had long hair. Um, but, yeah, so now we're pink. Ugh. Like, I don't want to get any closer than this, because when I tell you guys, my skin is awful. Awful. So, we're going to jump back on the wagon with skincare. We're going to take better care of ourselves. We're going to start making videos again. We just, we have to. Life presses on. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know. This is just a little, like, hangout thing. Um... I don't really know what to say, I guess, other than I'm sorry that I had to take a quick break, but I appreciate it. I am working on uh, coming back and, you know, hopping back on the wagon as far as daily filming. Um, I am hoping for the best, but you know, we'll see. We'll take it day by day starting tomorrow. Um, I work tomorrow, but I have the morning off, so maybe I can film and get ready with me and just kind of get back into it. But, um, yeah, thanks for hanging out with me and I look forward to uploading some more. <laughs>